Don't miss a beat, join the notification squad by clicking that bell, you'll get notified every time I upload a video, and be sure to join our Discord to talk and get help with your code. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Ned. Welcome back to our Discord.js coding tutorial series. Thank you for tuning in today. We're going to be doing something a little bit different. This is more so for the fun side. I know we've been kind of sticking towards like the moderation and administration or administrative commands. So we're going to have a little fun with some random dogs and cats. So I'm going to go ahead. Well, let's go ahead and go over what we're doing. Let me just go ahead and go back to the page. So this is random.dog. It is a website that pops up a random dog picture or GIF every single time. So they have made it accessible for us by doing wolf.json. And then we can pull from this JSON file a random image. So as you see, it, it changes every time right here. Um, we also have something called random.cat slash meow. And that's going to be the same kind of deal pulls a different image each time. So I already have my command set up. Let's go ahead and jump into the PowerShell. Um, we have to do npm install super agent. And why that, while that installs, I guess I can go ahead and go over um, what super agent is. So super agent is a lightweight progressive Ajax API, if I'm just quoting it straight from the website, but it's gonna make it so we can pick up different things on different websites and yeah, it just makes it a lot more possibilities uh, for what you can do in your bot. So let's go ahead and double check. That's done. Um, I'm going to dive right into the code. So the first thing we're going to need is const super agent equals required super agent. And that's right up here at the top. Um, so I already have that. So now we need to do let, and then we're going to call this body. And that's just going to grab it from, since this is, if we go to view, oh, not know what I do. Okay. Well, that's kind of what I'm looking for. Oop. So if we go to view um, page source or inspect, doesn't really matter. Uh, you can see it's inside the body, so we need to call it that. Um, that's just going to make it easier. Equals await super agent. And then enter and then dot get. And then we can put the API here. So we're doing doggo first, so let's do doggo command first. And then we can end that with a semicolon. That is done. And now we're just going to create a new embed dog embed equal new discord dot j or dot rich embed rather. And then set color. Let's grab a color real quick. I used that one last time, so we'll do that. This is my second time recording, so another night dot set color. Not. Okay, set title um, doggo. And then set image, and we're gonna do body dot, and for doggo, it's going to be a URL. So, URL. This is just like grabbing from your own bot config or bot settings or whatever you have it named, um, or just like grabbing from warnings. Um, it's just gonna save that, or it's just gonna access this JSON um, from your bot. So, let's go ahead and do message dot channel dot send, and then dog embed. And we should be good to go. Hopefully I didn't forget anything this time. So node index.js. Everything loads. All right, let's pop on over here. As I you can see, I was testing it before. And there's our doggo. Yeah, so beautiful puppy. All right, so let's get some cats on this. Um, I'm just going to basically copy and paste everything because it's easy as that. And then we can rename this cat. And then we could do a cat here if we wanted to. We can even do dog here. All right. So right now we just need to change the link. I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste it from here. And if we take a look, we can see that it's not URL here. It's going to be file. So we need to do file here. Right. So you should be all set. Restart your bot. All right. So we have cat and doggo. Oh, where's the dog in this one? Oh, there he is. Sneaky little dog. 
All right, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this. I know this is probably more of a shorter episode, but um, I've been streaming lately, and I've kind of been doing stuff on the stream that I wanted to do here. So I'm sorry about that. Um, be sure to tune in on Saturdays, normally around noon Eastern time. I'll try to start up a stream. Um, and, yeah, I'll see you guys on Friday. Have a great rest of your week. Peace.